Hello everybody and welcome back to another video and today I'm playing the Cold of Care. It's a free game on Steam if you want it. Um, game's best enjoyable with sound on it. That's our message from our lovely sponsor, Hurston Enterprises. Before you get any ideas about sea life on the run, the octopus represents those bastard copies up north. It's a metaphor, you see. I tell ya, I love being up at 6 a.m. on a Monday. The sun rising over the city reminds me of all the life down there. All those good, stout-hearted Americans with jobs in their minds and capitalism in their hearts. Ah, uh, I sort of want to know what this is. Special guest that I'm Can interviewing today, Joanne. Hello, Charles. I'm excited to be here. Now, what's a good Christian woman like you doing out of the kitchen and on America's airwaves? I want to do that myself sometimes, Charles. What the music changed? It scared me. No, oh, just a little bit of pep. Yeah, sure. Oh, you can throw. <laughs> oh, never mind. Made your favorite meatloaf sandwich Mom, with. I can't talk. I no, this is now. Not... I'm gonna no, miss the bus. Oh, okay. Well, I love you. Are you tired of feeling taken for granted? You know it, Charles. Of course you are. We know all you family men work hard all day just to provide for the kiddos at the old ball and chain. And when do they ever say thank you? Hmm. Honey, I'll be out late again. 
Have dinner ready when I get back. Did that change? Yes, this truly is the American dream. Happy home, happy life, and happy wife. And what could be happy? We'll be back with more tales from all around the greatest country on earth after these messages. Huh? It might be time to lay off the morning wine. Ugh. Even when something's a little different around here, there's always a mess to clean up. Yeah, I've got that. Um, complete that.
dinner's ready. Sure. Sure. When Francis isn't sorting his trading cards and John isn't working on his novel, dinner can't come fast enough. But when they're busy, they can't be bothered. Ugh, might as well listen to the radio while I wait. And what a wonderful day it was! And if we have our way, we'll be living like this forever. Don't forget, anyone who wants different is a threat to our country. Be sure to report any strange happenings to... No, the same as last time, right? They shit the Freddy's music. Oh yeah. I could talk to this all day. What? If I have to politely remind John to stop stacking food against the fridge door again, I'll scream. Or I would. If he didn't always leave the room when I show womanly emotions. War bacon for me. Oh what a feeling. Good morning, America! We're back at it again on this bright and sunny morning. And aren't we glad that it's bright and sunny considering that freak storm over the Atlantic last night that certainly didn't give me any ideas about the fragility of our human lives. In other news, does the amount of salt you put on your meatloaf say something about how good of a wife you are? Tune in after the break to find out. This hasn't been the best game, but it's fun. Four. Four. Oh. Francis, don't forget your lunch. Next time, can you make lunch like Timmy's mom does? She gives him cookies. And don't you forget the meatloaf tonight, honey. I... <sighs> I never do. No, I don't want to cook this. Me. Today's broadcast brought to you by Houston Enterprises' new vacuum cleaner with brand new technology that keeps your house cleaner longer. But not too long, or you ladies back home would have nothing to do. We've got a testimonial today from one of our happy customers. Say hello to America, Susan Jones. Hi, Charles. It's a pleasure to be here. Susan Jones? Timmy's mom, PTA president, makes snide comments about my brownies. Now, Susan, you're a mother... PTA president and baker extraordinaire. Oh, I don't know if I'd say extraordinaire. I just know what I'm doing when some others <laughs> All right. struggle. That's definitely not normal. Susan Jones, Timmy's mom, PTA president, makes snide comments about my brownies. Now, Susan, you're a mother. Any second PTA now, president Charles from baker extraordinaire. is going to knock on the door and tell me this is all a weird franchise. Extraordinaire. And Susan will be there too. Doing. So marvel at how I haven't cleaned up before letting the company. Your plea Sure, Susan. Gibberish. Please don't talk gibberish to me, you fool. I'm actually just done. That was easy, guys. Now, where's the knife? There's a knife that can use this. Dinner's ready! In a minute. In a minute. Ugh. Well, that's it for me tonight, folks. Keep an eye out for anything strange. And don't forget... What? I'm not sure if I do this. Well, 
well. Well, I prefer floating bacon to floor bacon, though I can't say I'm a huge fan of either. Another day in American paradise, the greatest country on earth. Don't forget, everything's completely fine. Today's program is brought to you by... And that's not all. If you buy now, you'll get a free pair of binoculars to spy on your neighbors. I need a bacon. I can bacon. Why has this become so hard? Have a good day at school. Have a good day at work, dear. God damn it. What room? Buy a Hurston vacuum, he said. It will have your carpet sparkling like new. Yeah, yeah, give me a ring when it does the same thing for my ceiling. Yes, the Ying Magazine is here. Please take me away to a world of country melodrama where I don't have to worry about how my house might be possessed. Silver bullets, huh? You know what? Sure. Better safe than sorry. If only I hadn't sold the pistol when we had Francis. Silver bullets. Oh, no. Those silver bullets can't get here fast enough. Hey, whatever entity is doing this, please stop. I don't need any more cleaning to do. Okay, okay, I can take a hint. Getting really annoying. Cup, cup, cup. And there's fucking knife flying around too. I'm yeah, sorry, I can't. Um, Doing this, but he didn't fall. Bloody nuts. Dinner's ready. In a minute. In a minute. I should start cooking for the entity in the house. Maybe it will appreciate my cooking. I can't tell if that's a yes or a no. I'm going to say no. Good evening, listeners. Gee, did that day fly by with no strange happenings at all. For you night owls out there, here's the evening news. 
That storm out by the Atlantic seems to have cleared up. The Navy is setting out to investigate, to make sure it isn't something... else. Meanwhile, some odd fellow in Johansson County swears there's a new mountain on the horizon by his house. <laughs> oh, the things some folks will do for attention, am I right? If you live near that man, you'd best keep an eye on him for other unusual behavior. Wrong. Yeah. Good morning, everyone. So. Every day is a clean slate, a brand new start. Breakfast, as you all know, is the most important meal of the day. Except, of course, for the most important meal of the universe, where the old ones descend upon humanity and eat the sun. Broadcast is telling me that isn't a standard meal in most American households. My mistake. Hmm. God damn it, bacon. This is it. No. Bacon just floats to where the jumps to really annoying. Francis, are you there? Yeah, Timmy's dad is driving me to school. Oh, I can drive Timmy's you. Timmy's mom says that women shouldn't drive. Bye, honey. Oh, that's Timmy. Strange. My silver bullet shouldn't arrive until tomorrow. Oh, boy. From Susan? What did she have to say this time? Uh, so I saw your lawn was looking more drab than usual, and I thought... There's a gal who has Eldritch Demons in her home. Here's a book that might help. Wow, isn't that just so thoughtful of her? I've chained it to, to this unspeakable power. Wait, we escape, but you should be able to use it while it's closed. Okay, that's actually useful? Oh, I have to write her a nice thank you letter now, don't I? It means so much to me that you reached out, especially with your extraordinarily busy schedule. I'll be sure to send over some fresh brownies when I get the chance. I'll make them extra overcooked just for you. announcement from your local neighborhood watch over at your neighbors for dinner keep an eye out for strange happenings a dysfunctional dinner is the first sign of an unhappy home and a potential threat to your community come on charles i don't need you calling me out too wait a minute ah oh, i'm so french Is that not a lot of meat left? Jeez. Thank you. 
Things are getting really good right now. Dinner's ready. I'm working on my novel. I'm sorting my training cards. <laughs> Are you an unhappy housewife in your house life? Maybe so, Charles. Maybe so. Then stay tuned. We've got ten appliances that will make you the perfect house spouse. And they're so easy, we're sure even you ladies will be able to figure it out. And ten more reasons for Susan to brag about how rich she is at the next PTA meeting. Appliance one. A safe lined with iron to keep the manuscripts describing all the horrors you've seen. Uh -huh. And five down is completely for time of the year. Those are the answers to yesterday's crossword. Hope you had fun playing along with us. Strange words this time. What is that, Lithuanian? Darn, I thought it was Cthulhu Patagon Arlie. So close. Before I release the bacon. Wait a minute, is everything completely just floating from now on? Be sure to be safe out there, Francis. There's been strange news lately. I'll be fine, Mom. Timmy's dad is picking me up from school, and Timmy's mom is going to make me brownies after. Honey, have you noticed anything odd lately? Come to think of it, your meatloaf was a little dry yesterday. It's all right. I'll pick up pizza tonight. Oh, perfect. My bullets are here. Now, I might not have a gun, and most sources say you need a gun to use bullets, but most sources aren't losing their mind trying to be a good wife and mother while demons are in their house. So I'll be taking some liberties. Now this is what I'm talking about. I don't know when I'll need it, but better safe than sorry. Wait, what's that chair? 
Tonight's broadcast is brought to you by The Stars Are Right, your number one guide to the stars being right. Also providing services like seeing if the stars are right and making sure that they're the ones to send upon the world. Broadcast? What do you mean they're not a sponsor? The stars are right. The stars are right. It's right here. The stars are right. The stars are right. The stars are right. The stars are wrong. No, no, it's fine. I told you, I'm just going to share the joyous news that the, the old ones are returning, returning and they're charting their boat to the second city of Yeah, and that Calamari is on sale at Kingamar today. 50% off. Yes. Oh, we're on air now? Hello, everyone. Calamari is on sale at Gigamart today. Add a bit of extra kick to your morning smoothie with some tasty sea life. Delicious. Actually, that doesn't sound delicious at all. Well, anyhow, it's a Saturday. Time to kick back and relax after a long, hard week of work providing for your families. And hey, maybe your wives can take a break, too. Jesus. Well, that'll be it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, tell me in the comments if you want me to do another video on this. Oh, jeez, this is my life. But, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.